Okay, this is a very specific storyline. Uh, may not resonate with all of you guys, but this is part three for April 12th, 13th, 14th. Now we have some Queen of Swords here. This could have been like, okay, this could be varied here. Queen of Swords is kind of cold, kind of direct, kind of not emotional, not emotionally available. I feel like you were dealing with someone who always felt perhaps that you were at a distance or they couldn't get through to you with the star or you felt like that with them but what i was gonna say in part two is that i feel like you cut this person off you walked away because you didn't feel like they were treating you right but in their mind they still don't understand what they did wrong because they're not aware of how they were kind of sometimes not really nice they weren't supportive of you you didn't feel like they had your back you felt like maybe they chose other people over you or they just weren't compassionate when you were expressing yourself and you just got tired of it and you created a distance with this person and you kind of cut things off to where they don't have access to you and that pisses them off um but because i also feel like they're kind of threatened by the fact that you are not codependent like you don't really need anything from them and they actually held on to you longer but they made you feel like it's like they needed you and they wanted you but then when you gave in all they did was make you feel bad in the dynamic it was like very toxic almost like borderline abusive um it's kind of twisted because in the heart of their heart of hearts i feel like this person does want to work on things but then when you're in their vicinity they push you away with their nonsense and i just feel like you guys want something healthy you feel like every time you gave into them it was a bad judgment call you felt like karma was there you felt like it wasn't working out so the only way that this is going to change is if this person gains more self-awareness 